would find the nearest wall. I would take my head and I would just start banging my head on the wall like that. Um, I ended up getting a lot of things because I did that. But uh, after about a year and a half, my parents got fed up with it. My mom, I got mad one day. My mom came over, took my head, helped me slam it into the wall for me. Uh, I also grew up with a nanny. And she always watched TV. So she would always sit in the same spot on the same couch. So one day I took a bunch of toothpicks and I put them in the in the chair in the sofa. Hoping that she would sit down because I thought she watched too much TV. Um, one hour later, I forgot I put it there. I ended up sitting on it myself. Um, the point of these stories is that I was a really disobedient kid. I always looked for trouble, um, but my parents, they always uh, loved me and took care of me. They raised me in the church um, in California. I attended high school in California, and I eventually went to Harvard University. Uh, coming out of college, I signed with the Golden State Warriors. Right when I signed, I remember um, I had media, I uh, had a lot of attention. Um, everyone was calling, calling me, texting me. And uh, most importantly, I got a thousand Facebook friend requests. I thought I was so cool, and I was like, this NBA thing, this is really nice. But as many of you guys know, I had a terrible rookie year. I never played except in blowouts. And even, go ahead. And uh, even when I did get in, I never played well. I got, eventually got sent to the D League all three times. The D League was definitely the toughest time in my career. Because I felt like one bad game and I could lose my job. I was actually so stressed, I couldn't eat or sleep the day before or the day of a game. And anybody who really knows me knows how much I eat. Uh, two weeks ago on my birthday, I gained seven pounds. Seven, eight pounds. Um, so for me, um, to not even be able to eat uh, was a very big deal. And I remember on December 29th, 2010, um, I wrote in my diary. Um, I know it's kind of girly to keep a diary, but I do it anyways. Um, I wrote, this is probably the closest to depression I've been. I'm lacking confidence on the court. I don't like playing basketball. And I feel embarrassed and like a failure. Uh, I still remember many nights um, where I couldn't fall asleep and I would just be in my bed crying. Because I thought I was letting everybody else down. I thought that if I didn't play well, I may never play in the NBA again. I eventually uh, wished I had never signed with Golden State. And I 
But I got through the rest of the se- my rookie season and into the lockout. 然后后来呢，第一年就这样过去了，进入到 NBA 封管的时期。And I told myself going into my second season. 我就跟自己说，进入到第二个球季。If this is my last season in the NBA, I'm going to give my best effort and play only for God. 如果这是我最后一年打 NBA 的话，我要努力尽全力的来打，然后就是为神来打。I don't want to put any extra pressure to play well for everybody else. 我不要给自己任何额外的压力，为任何人来打球。So when the season finally started in December. I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived midway through the first practice by Golden State. So, when the season started in December, I was waived Uh, eventually, on Christmas, Houston waived me as well. In Christmas Day, Houston waived me as well. New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up off of waivers. New York New York picked me up So again, I was wondering why I was there. So 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 I was wondering why I